I chose W and J because I feel like they've fit my needs financially, athletically, and academically like the best out of all schools I applied and was accepted to. So you know, it was an easy choice. And my first day was actually better than I expected it to be. You know, it felt really smooth. I had my own space to function, you know, the feel of independence and the freedom. And you really gotta embrace it to enjoy it. Having an advisor in high school uh, really prepared me to have one now. Um, it teaches our responsibility of like how your grades are really up to you. Um, so if you really want something done or you need extra help, so you need to go see somebody. You can't expect someone to come out to you. So you know you talk with your advisors, your professors. Um, it also keeps you like accountable. And make sure you're constantly checking your grades, getting your work done. Um, you know things like study hall and tutorial teach you to, uh, you know, try to do work at different times in the day. You know, you're not always gonna be able to crunch in work, you know, just at night. You might need to just stop in the middle of the afternoon and get some homework done. I also wanna give a shout out to uh, Mr. Joshua Simpson. He was my advisor coming in, really did the same thing as Dr. Anthony Williams. But, um, you know, we felt like we built a really close bond. He, he's more like an older brother to me. We did a lot of writing, but it wasn't just writing papers. We had to do our own research, um, even create our own topics sometimes. And then you're writing papers, you know, eighth grade, we started out with three pages and you know, that's some other people's senior projects. So, uh, you know, 11th grade, we had our history conference. Senior year, we had a um, senior seminar. So, you know, writing those big extensive research papers really prepare you for college because it's a lot of writing. Yeah, even in math courses, sometimes you have to do write-ups, so it's, it's really good to have the TNA curriculum coming into college. Mr. Gary Shawley, uh, he was my reading and writing teacher, English teacher, so I, I thank him for his, his rigorous curriculum and teaching, uh, homework assignments, you know, making everything due eight in the morning. It really kept me on my heels and uh, it forced me to really like get into my writing because it, I say he, he told me that I was a good writer, but I didn't like to write, and so he wanted me to really put the effort in so that the results showed. Dr. Anthony Williams, um, you know, he really helped me, you know, coming through TNA. Reverend Thomas Johnson, um, he was my basketball coach for five years. Uh, he was also the head of school when I was coming in, so you know his his strictness and. He was, I thought like he was really hard on me because he really took a liking to me, so he really wanted what was best for me all the time. And I appreciate how hard he was because it, it kept me going. I also want to give a shout out to my mom and dad. Um, you know, they really, I say, did a good job, you know, raising me, even though we were in separate homes. So, you know, just both doing their part and putting in my life, my step parents, because they, they co parented with them my grandmother, my aunt, you know, I guess say all my extended family, you know, because everybody contributes. You know, sometimes I feel like it's easy to feel like you're out here by yourself, especially with, you know, the whole COVID situation going on. Um, I've yet to feel alone, even though I'm by myself a lot. So, you know, I really appreciate everybody in the TNA community. The Neighborhood Academy, not a promise, but a guarantee. Got it. Uh, am I saying the Neighborhood Academy in front of that? The neighborhood, ooh, ooh. Uh -huh. <laughs> I think she's writing it. I said, cause she wasn't, I was gonna type it down. <laughs> but the neighborhood academy, not a promise, but a guarantee.